evacuation process. Hey. Someone should say something. You want me to? He never really joined us. Not officially. He was too much his own man, alone. Why do we need tribes, he used to say, when everyone on the planet is connected? And yet, in some ways, he represented everything Amara stands for. Gentleness, kindness, but also strength. And now he's gone, the world is a scary place. But we have to carry on. We have to celebrate his life and what he stood for. I just haven't been to many funerals. Not since the virus. It's just brought it all back, that's all. I know how much you cared for him, May. But it's gonna be okay, really. What do you mean? We've lost friends before. But whenever we lose someone, the tribe grows stronger. We will get through this. You'll see. All right. Thanks. If you think about it, it could have been a lot worse. We could have lost Elaine, too. That's it. That's all you can find. There's a whole city out there, Slade. It's a computer, isn't it? Yeah, I need lots of them to link up together. Understand? Look, if you want me to build something, I need processors, hard drive, and memory. Lots and lots of memory. Anything else, like software? I don't run software. I write it. Just get me some memory, okay? What exactly are you gonna do with this computer when it's all linked up, huh? <laughs> you tell me, Sled. I mean, this was your idea, wasn't it? To put RAM to good use. Uh, I'm afraid that RAM without a computer, it's just no use at all. Memory. I don't mean to hurry you, but the kids are on their own at the mall. That was beautiful what Celine said about him being home. He'd have been home a lot sooner if it wasn't for me and my wonderful principles. He'd be alive, too. No, Amber, there's nothing to discuss. Not with Celine's life on the line. You can't blame yourself, Amber. Pride only did what he wanted to do. And as for his principles, well, I think they're the same as yours. This is unbelievable. When Celine's life's on the line, Ram's too dangerous. But as soon as you want the power back on, hey, let's get him back here. That's a turn up. Telling me not to blame myself. 
Isn't that what I'm supposed to say to you? First rule of conquering a people. Get them scared and keep them that way. That's where Ram got it all wrong. He thought you could buy them off with paradise, but you give them candy, they just keep coming back for more. Until one day, no more candy. You never run out of fear, though. That's the secret. A brand new day is coming, Stats. We're gonna rule over this city. And the whole empire. Maybe the world. It's such a pity you won't be there to see it. I wanted to thank you, May. Thank me? What for? I know you did your best trying to make a deal with those creeps to get me released. Not knowing what they were going to do, I mean, for all you knew, they could have taken you prisoner. Yeah, there was nothing. Really. Hey, I'm proud of you, how you handled it back there. It was all an act. To tell you the truth, Amber, I wish they'd killed me instead of fright. Get down! you have to remember. He's up there right now, in the sky, with his mummy and daddy, looking down on us. Celine said they took him to the woods. His body's in the woods, but his spirit's in the sky. Don't they teach your kids anything? Wherever he went, he's not coming back, is he? You mustn't think about that. You'll make ourselves miserable. The best thing we can do is try to find a way to cheer ourselves up. I know. Let's have a fashion parade. I'll teach you how to walk like a real model. If you wouldn't mind, I think we'll stay miserable just a little bit longer. See yourself. Hey, Ruby. How's it going? What's all that for? This. Uh, Gabe likes to play solitaire. And he hates cards. Says they're dirty. What can you do? You know we don't allow paradise in this place. No, ma'am. No chance of any paradise for me. It's all right, Celine. We're home now. I'll take her from here. Is she all right? She'll be fine. Jay, I'm here. What happened? Ebony is what happened. They were going crazy for Zoot out there. My broadcast achieved nothing. If anything, it made things worse. You could be right. Well, what do you think? That Zoot image was obviously a fake. A computer image, maybe? Or uh, a hologram. You know about these kinds of things? Well, no, it wasn't Zoot. And a hologram will give you that halo-like effect. Whatever it is, Ram's behind it. No one else in the city has that kind of technology. What about Ebony? You see her out there? She's running up the old gang. It's like Loco City. Yeah, and some new kids, too, from out of town. Right. So what are we waiting for? Let's go and hit him. What? Now? You got something better to do? <laughs> I mean, we, I mean, we're pretty outnumbered. We could take the stun guns. Might even the odds. No. Even with the stun guns, you've just finished burying your friend. You won't be a match for Ebony, not in this state. Every day we wait, Ebony gets stronger. Yeah, Lex, but Meg is right. We're not ready. Talking of burying our friend, what about the scumbags that wasted him? Well, Celine took care of Wizard. As for the other one, Stats, he disappeared. I wouldn't worry about him, and I will never see him again. Do you know who I am? Should I? I'm the leader of the Jackals. You better let me go or there'll be trouble. Did you hear that, my lord? A Jackal. Oh, what should we do with him? 
Arrest him. Good idea. Who's she talking to? Zoot says jackals are the favorite food of lions. Take them away. Some honeymoon? What? Mr. and Mrs. Zoot over there. I don't know how you can joke about this, Java. She stole our sister. What's the matter with you? Are you going soft on me? I agreed to use her fantasies to get what we want. I just didn't think she'd take it this far. Relax. Look at the fear she's generating. Oh, it's going to be a breeze to take over the city. Everything's working out better than I dreamed it would. Besides, I'm kind of jealous of her. Jealous? Of Ebony? Why not? She's got her fantasy guy. And since he's not real, he can't dump her. <laughs> oh, it's a marriage made in heaven. Is she gonna be all right? Yeah, Celine's upset. She just needs to rest. Then why did she faint? Gail said she saw something in the city, something bad. Try not to worry about it, Mouse. Come on, let's get you something to eat. Are you just gonna sit there while Ebony builds an army out there? Seems a shame, doesn't it? After we risked our necks to feeding Ram. So what do you suggest we do? What, we go and round them up, just the two of us? We take some of the troops. At least track them down, find out where their base is. Come on, Jay. Look, Mega said Since that... when has Mega run the show? Don't let's make a meeting out of this. It's guy stuff. Right? All right. I'll run up to some men. Great. Jack, get over here. Yeah, what's up? You just volunteered for special duty. Tragic affair. Excuse me? This business with pride, very tragic. Yeah. <sighs> Especially for you. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, it's just that there was a rumor going around that you and pride, well, that you cared for each other at one time. So? So, it was good news for Celine when you were captured by the bad old technos. As soon as your back was turned, she moves in. That's gotta hurt. Get out of here. Actually, I was just leaving. When you come back with me to the hotel, we'll talk some more. We've got nothing to talk about. Oh, I don't know. We've got a lot in common, May. You're pretty cool. You got a lot of guts. Like right now, you're breaking up inside, but you keep it under control. I like that. Are you gonna cut to the chase? I know you lied to Wizard, telling him the mole rats wouldn't play ball, practically begging him to delete Selene. <laughs> Wait a minute. But it didn't work out that way, did it? That's what happens when emotions get in the way. Now pride's dead and all you want to do is cry, like her. Cry like you've never cried before. But you can't, because you're wondering if they already suspect the truth. What do you want? Like I said, to talk. Don't worry, your secret's safe. I'm the only one who knows. I think. Look at this place. Yeah. No one treasure the town quite like a bunch of locals. Yeah, well, at least they're easy to track. Jack, what's the kid down with you? see anything up there? No, 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 nothing here. See these, um, the holograms and projectors and the projectors seem to be mounted somehow, so... Thanks for the science lesson, but we have got a job. Not alone, my bride. Ebony, can I talk with you? What's the problem? No problem. I just wanted to know, are you okay? You know, are you happy? Strange kind of question to ask a new bride. That's right, Ebony. Well, yeah, but, but that's because it's all been so sudden. I'm concerned for you, that's all. No need to be. 
I'm following my destiny. Tell him where it's at. With Zoo. One day, when you're all alone, wondering what to do with your life, then suddenly, you get swept off your feet and put on the right path. What about Jay? Didn't you once have those kind of feelings for him? How can you compare a mere mortal with a god? The only god. I I'm sorry, I didn't mean. No need to be. As long as you don't become blind to Zoot's message, as I was once. We have to give up worldly things, Siva. We have to let Zoot into our hearts. Nothing else matters. Selene, can I ask you something? What is it? Those guys that kidnapped you, did they say anything about anything? Like what? Oh, you know, like where they were going to set up base, or where they were heading, or how the negotiations were going, that kind of thing. They kept me pretty much in the dark. What do you ask? Oh, I just... I, I want to find that guy, the one called Stats. I, I really hate him for what he did to you. And I just thought you might have some clues. May, there's no point in going after him. Getting revenge on him won't bring Pride back. Besides, I don't think Pride would want you to put yourself in danger. I guess not. Well, thanks. Don't go. Sit with me for a while. I feel a lot closer to you now after all we've been through. Me too. May, can I tell you something? I haven't even told Amber yet. Sure. You know the night before the raid on the Technos? When we knew we might be walking into a trap? Remember? Yeah. Well, Pride asked me to marry him. We were going to be married, May. What is it? Maybe you're better off. What? Well, he may have said that. I mean, people say all kinds of things, but if I know Pride, he wasn't really the marrying type. Look, he was a free spirit. You know that. His home was in the woods, and I just don't think he would have given that up. Not for anyone. <sighs> Turn it on. What a better place to look for Zoot. In a zoo. Has some tribe been running this place since the virus? I don't know. to a decision. What about? This was Pride's. Yeah, I know. It's his amulet. Every Eco tribe member is given one when they join. I was going to keep it to remember him by. That's a good idea. Pride never found at home in the mall. So it feels wrong to keep this here. It should go back to the Eco tribe. I want to give him back, Amber. I want to give him back to the Ecos. But I want you to come with me, because I don't think I can do it on my own. What brought this on? Something May said, actually. She helped me realize I need to let go. <laughs> May, promise. Promise what? 
tells me I love her. What are you doing now? Familiarizing myself, getting to know the machine. You really understand these things? I wouldn't know what to do with one. Well, I wouldn't know what to do without one, so I guess that makes us even. Of course, you have an advantage over me. Yeah, I'm intelligent. <laughs> no, I meant being stuck in a wheelchair. I was wondering, is that how you got started? Looking for something to do? Look, do you mind? It's not a toy. Oh, sorry. Now, if you finished wrecking the equipment, I'd kind of like to concentrate. It was afterwards, wasn't it? What? The accident. Whatever happened to you. It was after you took up with computers, maybe because of one? Maybe you're not so stupid after all. Of course, you don't have to tell me. Look, what do you know about reality space? Is that like paradise? This was before the days of paradise. Back in those days, we had no safety features. Didn't know we'd need them. Just strap yourself in and enjoy the ride. It was a blast. <laughs> Look, when you were a kid, do you ever dream you were running down the street? And then suddenly, you just took off, leaving the ground behind. And there I was thinking it was just about clicking a mouse. You tried to fly, didn't you? Fell off a 20-foot high wall onto concrete. Once I dreamed of flying around the world, now I'd be pleased if I could walk across this room. Satisfied? All right, I'm here. What's this all about? Uh, guys, would you give us a minute? You might want to keep your voice down. You can't prove anything. Tell them it's whatever you want. It's your word against mine. You're forgetting stats. No, he got away. Didn't he? That's true, he did. But not before we had a little chat. We thought they didn't care about Celine pay any ransom for her. That's what May told us. She said, we'd better waste Celine. Otherwise, if she ever got free, we'd be dead men. 